We got some younger guys here, it looks like, tonight, right? All right. We got a target, a volunteer. Uh, all right. What's your name, sir? Jade? Jade. Okay, that's a girly name, but all right. Uh, cool. No, it's all right. I love it. Uh, can I ask your age? Oh, 22. That is an awesome. Oh, see, they're all jealous. That's what it is. No. Yeah, 22 is an awesome age. It is incredible. Now, I got something to tell you, and I don't mean to bring you down. I know you're here for a good time, but I hate to tell you this. Right now, at this very moment, is the most beautiful your balls are ever going to look. <laughs> it's true. I know you're probably thinking, like, well, they ain't lookers now. Uh, trust me, it gets worse. Uh, because remember, guys, when we were young in our 20s and, you know, our balls were like two best friends, right? And they, they lived together in a little studio apartment. Oh, and they loved it. All that close-knit, you know, oh, like when it would get chilly out, they'd, they'd snuggle up together to keep warm, right? Oh, they loved it. Yeah. But see, what happens, Jade, you're going to get to like your mid-40s, close to 50. You're going to wake up one day and realize that one of your balls went bungee jumping and never came back. <laughs> It's, it's a bad, I guess he gets like, you know, he's like, I need to go out and for adventure and see the world. And then he gets lost, can't make his way back. And that's a bad day, because you got to relearn to walk, your balance is off. <laughs> got to learn how to sit on a chair, right? Like, which leg do I cross? Like, where, where does it go? I don't know. And then a year or two later, your other ball, he gets lonely. He goes looking for his buddy, but they never seem to meet up. I don't know. It's always this lopsided bolo whip of not sexy. I don't know. And if you ladies think I'm making this up, I'm going to give you a little hint how to tell if a guy is actually at that point in life. All you have to do is watch when he gets up from a seated position after sitting for like 10, 15 minutes. Because if he does this... <laughs> that is him dislodging a nut from his thigh. That is what that is right there. I'll be honest, sometimes you sit too long, one of them slides down in your ass crack, and you go, ah, yeah. And this is why little old guys wear their pants so high, by the way. It's to keep their junk in place. Like I said, I've been to the villages. You don't want to see a ball rolling out of a pants leg getting tangled in a flip-flop. That is not a good day.